Okay. This is a uh, basically a home popcorn maker, but that nobody uses anymore. So I got it at Goodwill for uh -huh. two bucks. A lot of people don't realize that coffee beans are green. You know? Yeah. They always think they're. Yeah, this is actual coffee beans from Ethiopia, which Starbucks buys for and will sell you for fifteen wow. bucks a pound. Okay. But. And you put these here outside on your balcony. I tried to used to I used to try to do it in my in a frying pan, but it would smoke up the place on the back. So it's just grinding up the beans. No, it's not grinding anything. Oh, what's it's, it doing? It's, it's heating them so oh, that they will turn I into see. like a brown okay. coffee. Bag. Right. So it's it's cooking the beans. Uh, yeah. It's basically my cheese and stuff. Yeah, and it's a like a Swiss Army knife? Or and what a Swiss is that? Army knife. And, this, and right. okay. this is called the captain's knife because they wouldn't let the captain's knife is the only one who got the corkscrew. I grew up in the, where they, when they still had Latin in the church. The right. Church. My father was a an executive at United Artists, the movie company. Right. And although he didn't grow up with money, he grew up with nothing. Uh, but he was on the ground floor of the film industry. Right. And so he traded up, you know. Um, he had a lot of kids and by the time I came along. So you're the youngest of eight children. I'm the youngest of eight children. And uh, So that must have been hard. hard. Like in a sense that your parents are already kind of tired by that point, right? <laughs> uh, you get a lot of bosses, you know. Yeah. Like when you're the youngest of eight. Yeah. Yeah. What happened here? Somebody flipped it over, eh? This is Alan's garden. Right. Same look, at, look at all the symbiotic thing here, right? Look at these birds. There's a whole like I got this discovery thing out of like in a good blue. It was like a buck, yeah. buck for the But it's a, a real video, right? It's not about the lap Right. And it's so interesting. Some of these birds, they they uh, they don't hunt at all. They just steal. Oh well, you know, like that, I like that I he learned, really I, I hated him was back. a loving. I hated him know. until the end. Right. You know, and, and 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 I have a letter to this day that I wrote to him, which I'll let you read if I can find it. Uh, <laughs> no, but my mother told me he carried that to his, to right. his grave. Okay, yeah. he came, walked around with my letter in his yeah. pocket, and it was basically I was at Rochdale, me writing to him to explain why I was chose to become a musician right. and the positive buzz that I get off of playing music right. and you know that something that money can't buy it's sure. like people talk about dance like that you know if you well, have any that, art form. or any art form. I mean I think that stand up comedy, no, honestly you know? I think like deep down you know like granddad you know that's you know, in a way, that's why he was in the, the film business. Of course. You know what I mean? And like he the sent Jack away, Robinson story, he that sent, was he his sent baby, away, really. He sent away for a uh, fiddle, you know, and it didn't, it didn't come. He paid, you know, like... Really? Yeah. He sent away for fiddle when yeah. he was a kid? Yeah. Huh. You know what? It's possible that it came and his father never gave it to that him. That is possible. You know, and, and like... The book is brilliant. It's the first kind of stream of consciousness. Right, right. Everything happens in one day, and it's like so far out. Right. You know, it, you, you'll love it. Once you get into it, it's like, I mean, see, the thing is that the people that have affected my life have been.
because I got to sneak into his seminars. I wasn't qualified, but that was really cool. Then I realized, well, who's Marshall McLuhan's hero? Okay, Marshall McLuhan's hero is this James Joyce. Right. He got all his shit from T.S. Eliot. He was a professor of English literature. All his theories come from these poets. Okay. You know, he was saying right. like, it, it was like, McLuhan's thing is art precedes. Uh, the artists are the antenna of the race. Right. They right. they see the trends happening. Right. And and he was saying like, for example, television wouldn't exist if if there wasn't that whatever they call it point silla painting style mm, in in uh, French. Uh, impressionistic right. painting where everything is dots. If you right, look at right. it up close, all you see is right, dots. Right, right. You move back 40 right. feet, you see the whole thing. Yeah. And television is basically those yeah. dots. Same so, with computers. Yeah. Pixelation. Pix yeah. Exactly. And this thing on the CBC, you know, it's like one of those ideas programs, yeah. folklore thing. And uh, I could hear this voice. And I called Brian Marion, who was in Saskatchewan at the time. I got through to him at his mother's place. And I said, Brian, I said, I said, I could hear a normal voice. Now, this is me not knowing that he was dying not a mile from here. Wow. Like in a Toronto hospital. Um, wow. This guy kept him so secluded from some, so it's like, it was like this. So people say it's like, uh, you know, their way of saying goodbye. Yeah, you know? absolutely. I remember the book being around the house, The Sacred this Mushroom is, and the Cross. Yeah. And that same mushroom was the Alice in Wonderland. Right, 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 right. Uh, see the serpent? Yeah. The, the fruit of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil? Right. With the serpent around it? This guy was hounded to his death. That's what's at the farm, right? This is what I want to make this. I want to make the story of this, but not in. A, and I got volunteers who are ready to do it. Let's hope this is. I don't know where it is. It might be here. Yeah. Oh, I got my picture on it. Did I tell you I got my picture? Where the hell is that? Here's me and Brandy and Rick. Oh yeah, I did see that. Yeah, I but saw I that. another one where I'm on the cover of That's the goddamn cool. star, right? And, and it's so funny because Kingsley calls me and he goes, you made the cover of the entertainment section. I thought he was joking, right? Oh, yeah? But it's a great shot. It's, I can't find it. It's an sh action shot of me, right? Which doesn't happen too often. You're going to get all my bad spelling in that. I'd rather recite that. <laughs> Let's see. So you, he carried this with him until yeah. he died. Yeah, he did. That's really nice. This is a, 